In this video, Sunny and I play hide and seek banned house edition. Pretty much each round, there are two houses and the hider picks one to hide in. The seeker can then ban one of the houses, causing it to be deleted. If the hider is in the deleted house, then it's game over. Otherwise, the seeker will have three minutes to search the other house and find the hider. If you guys could pretty please click that big red subscribe button, it would be greatly appreciated. It's time for the Brookhaven hide and seek house ban challenge. Melon, are you ready? Let's do this thing, Sunny. I'm hiding first, bro, which means you need to go in this little tiny playhouse and close your eyes, okay? No cheating. I'm putting it right here on this grass, okay? Okay, I won't look. I pinky promise. Okay, guys, it's my turn to hide. I'm gonna choose between Melon's Mansion and the Sunny Mansion. Mine's way more festive. I turned it green. Let's go inside and I gotta be very selective with my hiding spot. Maybe I'll go in this Christmas tree or maybe, just maybe, your boy's got a crazy plan. So I'm gonna actually hide right here so that as soon as Melon enters my house, I can click on him and I'm gonna ban him from my house entirely. Ban, 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 ban. Now I've just got to hope he doesn't delete my house. That would be really sad. Hopefully he bans his own home. Actually, guys, I made myself really small. I'm gonna go inside the plant pot right next to the entrance. And I know I have my little red Santa hat sticking up. So let me just get rid of that really quick like this. Boom. Now I'm invisible. Okay, Melon, I'm ready. All right, which house do I ban? Well, I'm actually gonna be very logical here, Sonny, and I'm gonna ban my own house because it's way bigger and way more complicated than your stupid little dumb house. No, please don't do it. Please, Melon. I bet you're in here. Get banned. <laughs> Wait, why you're not in here? Bro, of course I'm not in your house. Why would I ever choose your house? Well, I guess I'm gonna find you in your very own household. Bro, unlock the doors. Let me in. Fine, I won't cheat. Psych! Sonny, what is wrong with you? That's right, Melon. Get banned. If you can't come in my house, you can't find me. How am I supposed to get you, Sonny? What is the point of this game? I just wanted to troll you and feel good about myself before Christmas. And I feel pretty good right now. Guys, for real though, I'm gonna just hide under the staircase back here. I don't think Melon knows about this secret spot. I feel like we Harry Potter right else. now. Okay, guys, Sonny wants to be a dirty little cheat, right? So I actually called up my cousin. Let me show you who I'm talking about. All right, this is a big deal, guys. I'm introducing you to my family, Business Melon. He's my third cousin, and I look up to him like a father. Check this dude out. Look how pretty he is. Business Melon, I need you to get in my car right now. All right, guys, he's just a little bit quiet, but that's because his mind's always on the money and finding Sonny. That rhymed, and that was completely unintentional. All right, Business Melon, hop in my shopping cart, and we're gonna have the best time. You know, I don't think anyone's ever told you this, but you're quite handsome, just like me. But your melon is kind of on the wrong way. Like, I don't really know what happened there. But now, I gotta find this sweet spot, Business Melon. So I'm gonna drive you into this wall, and hopefully we can squeeze through. Come on, please! Let's go! We made it! Now, where is is Sonny. I bet you he's in here somewhere. Come on. Maybe he's under the stairs. Yo, let's go. I found you. Are you serious? Why would you check under the stairs first thing? Bro, honestly, I found that spot earlier in this house and I thought it was really cool. So I just wanted to check there right away. Wait a second. Who is this doofus in this cart? This is Business Melon. Don't make fun of him. He will drain your finance and drain you of all your future potential melons. Bruh, I don't want the melons. I want the Robux. Get out of my house. You guys are supposed to be banned. How did you even do this? Business Melon has his ways. Let's just say that. Melon, it's your turn to hide, bro. I'm gonna give you two minutes and no using business, Melon, to do any tricks. Okay, I can promise you one of those two things. I'm not telling you which one. Bruh. Okay, guys. So my two house options aren't that great, but clearly mine is worse, so he's probably gonna ban his own. So I'm gonna hide in here. What Sonny doesn't know is since he banned me from the last house, I'm gonna lock my own house so he can't get in. This is revenge at its finest. Now I just gotta find a hiding place in case he somehow manages to to break in. Could hide in this sink. That wouldn't be such a bad spot. Shrink down a little bit. That's pretty goofy. Imagine I just left my melon sticking out of the sink. No, I'm not gonna do that. So I'm gonna have to sit down. And now I'm completely invisible. All right, Sonny, I'm ready whenever you are. Let's do this thing. Leave the playhouse and sniff out that melon. Okay, would you have chosen my house? I got some nice lollipops out front for the holidays. Yo, so does yours. What the heck, bro? Why is your house already locked? Is this some weird reverse psychology? What about mine?
mine? Is mine locked? No, mine's open. I don't know if that's a clue or if you're just trying to troll me with that. I'm in your head, Sonny. I'm in your head. Literally rent free right now. I'm just trying to see which house is bigger. I'm going to use your strategy. My house might be a bit weirder to hide in, which means searching's going to suck. Because if I go up, it means I have to climb a ladder every time, which is going to waste a lot of energy. I'm going to ban my own home. Please be here. Be here. No, you're not. Okay, that's fine. You're so stupid, Sonny. Okay, Melon, I'm confident in my abilities to track you down and force you to eat fertilizer. So where are you? Don't worry about it. Melon, I don't care where you are. When I find you, I'm putting you in the grill master and I'm having some grilled melon. That's supposed to taste like ham, apparently. Let's just give this a quick tour of the outside, do a little swim. I feel like a fish right now. You know why I feel like a fish? It has nothing to do with the fact that I'm in water. It's because I'm gonna be efficient at tracking you down. <laughs> That's a good one, Sonny. Yeah, that was the weirdest laugh I think I've ever heard you do. It was sarcasm. Dude, there's actually a lot of posts and trees you can hide in. This is kind of annoying. Just keep browsing. Make sure you're nowhere on the outside, because then I'm gonna break into your house. I don't care if you locked it, dude. I'm coming in there. That's what he said. Good luck trying to get in, Sonny. Oh, I don't need luck. All I need is one handy dandy little sleeping bag. Yeah, that should do it. And would you look at that, Melon? I'm inside of your home, you fool. No! You weren't supposed to be able to do that. You thought a lock could stop me? Not even close, bro. I'm gonna check everywhere thoroughly because I still have three whole minutes. No, you have so much time. Better not be in this stupid sink doing this strategy. Nope, I don't see you. No, you're good. You're not there. Bro, you in this toilet? You went in the sewers? <laughs> Melon, where the heck are you hiding? I'm not hiding anywhere. Dude, your house is on fire. Oh my God. Dude, chill. I'm gonna burn. I'm too small to climb this ladder. That's toxic. I can't get up. Melon, stop burning your own house down. That's dangerous. It's just super hot fire. You can't handle the heat, Sonny? It's fine. I brought an extinguisher. Come on. Save the day. I'm a fireman. Yo, it actually worked. No cap. Wait, actually? It's almost gone. Save the kitchen. Save the apples and bananas. No, that's not how this is supposed to work. Kill the bathroom fire. Actually, no, the bathroom can burn. I don't care about that. You, sh you sure you don't want to put the bathroom out? Like, maybe you could put it out. Oh, thanks for putting it out, Sonny. You're so nice. Yeah, I already sprayed it with fire extinguisher. That was my bad. Dude, this house is tiny, actually. There's, like, nowhere for you to hide. Are you in this little pillow? Oh, Sonny, Sonny, Sonny. I think I know exactly what you did. All I need to do is grab a little bit of C4 dynamite. Boom! You're not in the safe? Nope, I am not. I could ask a question here. I got one per round, so I might as well ask. Have I been anywhere near you? Or are you, like, not even in here? Oh, you've been very, very close to me. The kitchen sink? You only got 30 seconds left, Sonny. This is so annoying. I don't understand. Is there a secret spot here? You may have been standing on me at one point. I won't lie. I'm just gonna drop some bombs in this toilet. Bro, keep dropping bombs. You only got 10 seconds left. I don't understand. Six, five. I heard something. Four, three, two. Two, one, let's go. Where the heck are you? You're not even under the sink. Yo, Sonny, check the toilet. No, there's actually no way you were in the toilet. <laughs> I'm just sitting on a toilet. Bruh. No, I was in this sink and last second I went into this toilet, bro. Are you kidding me? I heard the jump noise, so I thought maybe you jumped out of the sink. Nope, I just went in the toilet. Gee, gee, that's actually kind of epic. I gotta give you credit. Round two goes to the big man melon. I'm not losing another round ever. This this time, I get to hide. And bro, what kind of trash little house is this? It's a sick house. That's what it is. Bro, look at my Santa's workshop in comparison. There's just no comparing these two houses, dude. You're right, because mine is way more classical and has withstood the test of time. And mine's literally a toy shop. It's kind of not a house, actually. It's literally a place of business. Yeah, it's pretty lame. Whatever, bro. I have two minutes to hide. Let's go! Guys, I saw Melon spying on me from the playhouse. That's why I came into my workshop. And then I'm going to sneak out the back and I'm going to run carefully here all the way along the edge. I got to dip down though. I don't want him to see. Go back across where he can't spy on me. Perfect. He's going to think I'm inside of Santa's workshop, but I'm not. I'm going to go inside of his house, but I'm going to actually need a ladder. There we go. Up and over. Beautiful. Now, where do I want to 
hide here. Yo, they got that big satellite dish back here. What's inside of the main house? I gotta be really careful not to get caught. Zoom in. There's gotta be a secret in this place somewhere. Okay, guys, so I found something. It's not the greatest ever, but it's still pretty good. I can go inside of this old refrigerator or cabinet, whatever this is. So I can hide inside of this. It's not too bad. Melon, I'm ready. And I'm ready to seek. Now I'm gonna ban a house. And what am I gonna ban? This tiny little house or this gigantic house where you could hide in a million spots? Oh no, please, please don't ban Santa's workshop, please. You're gonna get coal for Christmas, don't do it. You know what? I feel like you're using reverse psychology on me, but I saw you walk into here, so I'm gonna ban Santa's workshop. No, I was using reverse, reverse psychology. No way you're not in there, are you kidding me? Get wrecked, bro. I was using inverted double reverse psychology. It's okay, I can check this stuff really quickly. There's like nothing in the backyard. It's pretty plain, so it's pretty easy to see everything. Yeah, other than this top secret, secret spot grave of death that I'm hiding in right now. Yeah, 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 I'm sure you're not inside or anything like that. Now, time to check the main entrance. Now, where are you? It's gonna be quick, easy run because there's nowhere to hide in this house. What is this sleeping bag doing? Nothing. <laughs> bro, where are you spawning these in from? Underneath you, bro. I told you I'm in a secret spot. Yo, I gotta shrink down. He's probably hiding in some sink or something stupid. Guys, that was my only play to distract him. Is he in here? <laughs> Yo, Sonny! There was nowhere to hide in this place. I was trying to find a secret spot and I didn't know of any and I couldn't find one. And then, yeah, I had nowhere else to go. Bro, you gave yourself away too. No, I was trying to distract you with the sleeping bag. Well, that just gave me a hint because I knew you could spawn it in from wherever you were. So you're actually just dumb. I was hoping you'd fall for it that I was underneath the house. Let's go. I'm going to ace you, Sonny. I'm going to win every single round. There's no chance of that happening. Just choose your next house for this round. Okay, guys, I'm gonna choose the worst house ever, which is, I don't know, actually. Which house is bad? I think they're all kind of cool. That's the problem. I'm gonna choose this one because it's see-through, so I can see everywhere he goes if he chooses to hide here. Okay, Melon, I see you've chosen a house, and I've got my lovely see-through home ready for you. Now I'm gonna go count. You got two minutes. One Mississippi to Mississippi. Oh my god, just stop, stop. I don't want to hear about Mississippi. Three Robloxians and four Robloxians. <sighs> okay, so he spawned this glass house in because he thinks I'm not going to hide in it. But the thing is, Melon accepts the challenge and I'm actually going to hide in his house. I just got to find a good spot. Wait, I can hide in this Christmas tree. There's so many spots I can hide in in this house. Guys, I'm using my house security cameras. There's no way I could let Melon win again. Where do I want to chill? I think maybe the Christmas tree is the vibes. Oh, wait. Could I do something with this? Falling through the cracks? Could this be useful? Guys, is he leaving the house? Where's he going? Oh my god, guys. This is a sick spot. I'm gonna hide right behind this black thing. I don't really know what this is. I can't tell from my angle. Wait, I can hide in this? This is actually perfect. I can juke him wherever he sees me. If he thinks he can see me from outside, boom, then I disappear in here. If he's inside, then boom, I disappear this way. Guys, I think I just saw a little red speck somewhere here. I'm pretty sure he's still hiding in my house. All right, Sonny. I'm ready whenever. Okay, Melon. Time for me to find you, dude. But the real question is, which house should I ban? Should I ban my see-through house? Which, if I just take a quick look... Yeah, there's no way you're hiding there. I'd be able to see you so fast. Or do I ban your crazy mansion? I don't know. Pick one and choose the wisest one. Yeah, all of that logic and deductive reasoning makes me think I should totally ban my house! Wait, 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 wait. You, go, you don't want to think about this for a second? Okay, let me think about it for a second. I'm going to turn it into the yellow goat house. There we go. Oh, it changes the glass color. I don't know if I really like that. It's not bright enough yellow. It kind of just looks weird. Uh, let's make it blue. That's nicer. Yeah, I still want to ban it. No, don't do it. No. Yes, I win. I got a W. Let's go. Oh my God. Why would you ban your house there? What is wrong with you? Because I'm cleaning up these streets, bro. Look at me go. You know what else we should be cleaning up? The like and subscribe buttons. And the next video on screen. Green. Make sure you click it, pretty please. But Melon, before they click it, I just want to tell you, I cheated. I used my house security cameras. I had to tell you, get it off my conscience. Are you kidding me? 